In Kwara State, top government officials, the leadership, candidates, as well as supporters of the All Progressives Congress are here at the campaign office for the inauguration of the council members. So help me God. Governor Abdul Rahman Abdul Razak is optimistic that the achievement of his administration will ease their task to win the hearts of the voters. Well, as a government, we've made your job very easy. It will be easy for you to go around the state and canvas for votes. Um, if I may say to myself, we've done exceedingly well. Now, if we go back to where we're coming from and where we are today, you're, you were all witnesses to the state the world, dilapidated infrastructure, non-payment of salary, non-payment of gratuity, embezzlement of UBEC funds, embezzlement of educational funds, right down to lack of water supply, poor state of infrastructure. Well, you can see we are overcoming all that gradually and we're doing exceedingly well in that department. It's high time we come out boldly boldly to tell the world that in Kwara State we only have two parties. We only have two parties, APC and others. A group known as the Coalition of Kwara APC Young Stakeholders is also mobilizing ahead of the election. We have put in place all measures to ensure effective mobilization of Tinubu, AA and all other candidates as we, em we are embarking our on our door-to-door -door conversing and campaign across the 193 wards and the 16 local government area in Kwara State. 147 groups across the 16 local government areas of the state make up the youth coalition and together with the campaign council members, they are optimistic that the party will emerge victorious.